Good morning everyone, Johnny FRX here. Got another video for you for my latest project. I decided to build a digital scale. We had a couple little scales laying around the house. You see them in the back right there. You got the white plastic special from the local uh, department store, maybe three dollars. And you can barely see the numbers and it's a little jiggly. You have one that shows up here and there on Amazon or the like this little guy here which is pretty accurate that's a 50 gram weight right there but they're pretty small here's my hand and here's the covering the entire platform and in the back we have the new Mac Daddy digital kitchen scale built with Arduino um, a couple parts that I did buy for this I got on Amazon but I wanted them fast in the back here you can see the HX711 that handles all the math and the uh, the input from the load cell you can see in here try and get a good shot that's a five kilo load cell um, that has what's called a wheatstone bridge which is a set of resistors you can see that smack of tape or seal over the top and the four wires running from it those run to the HX711 you can see in the back here and then the front end here runs up to the Arduino. Those are the only two parts that I bought. The uh, the controller or the HX711 module that came with the load cell. That was from DeGraw on Amazon. And then I also bought this little set of precision weights. Um, 50, 50 gram, a couple 20s, a 10 and a 1 I think. Um, that's from a company called Magicom with a K. And the rest of the parts I had laying around the house. The plastic platforms are from an old obstacle avoidance robot I cannibalized, and that turned out nice. And the LCD 1602, um, I put the I2C serial backpack on that to minimize the amount of lines we had to run from a bazillion down to four. And the nice thing with the voltage here is the HX711 runs on 2.6 to 6 volts. So we could plug that into the 3 volt on the Arduino. And the LCD runs on 5 volts. So we had plenty of juice for all the components. I'll give a little demo here. It automatically tears and I have it set to show grams, ounces, and pounds to make life easier in case you don't like to convert and there's 50 grams there's a little bit of float, calibration can be a little tricky on this just need to be persistent and all the code from Bogde, B-O-G-D-E his library and readme files up on the github will walk you through that process but you can see here you've got the grams, ounces and pounds all in one shot that's nice depending on what you're measuring any given time and I'd like to give a shout out to a youtuber Ralph Bacon um, I came across his videos that helped me immensely in building this little project the main reason we got this is we needed to keep track of the weight of our new bearded dragon so we needed a bigger platform and here we have it in addition then we can weigh food product etc. We like to buy in bulk and freeze so this will get it down to the pound level when we buy mass quantities of chicken, ground beef, whatever. Anyway, there's my latest project. Hope you enjoy. I'll try and put an instructables up. Any questions let me know. Thanks.